Macduff's Christmas by Rosemary Wells and Susan Jeffers. This is the title page. It was Christmas Eve. Lucy and Fred and Macduff scanned the snowy skies for a glimpse of Santa Claus's sleigh. Santa might not make it through this storm, said Fred. They put out a thermos of cocoa and shortbread sugar snaps for Santa when he came down the chimney. But nothing came down except the howling winter wind. Lucy walked Macduff in the snowy garden. Fred gave the baby a bottle. The baby is full, said Fred. Macduff is empty, said Lucy. They fell asleep to the snowing and blowing of the snowstorm. Suddenly, something thumped in the night. Macduff looked out the window with his ears in the radar position. Woof, said Macduff. Lucy woke up. No sleigh bells jingled. Fred woke up. No one was swooping down the chimney. Macduff woofed at the door to go out. The snow is over your head. You need a dog tunnel, said Fred. Fred dug Macduff a snow tunnel. Macduff went to the end of Fred's tunnel, but the thump was gone. He came in all wet and snowy. Lucy fell asleep. Fred fell asleep. Soon Macduff heard tapping far away in the night. Woof, said Macduff. It must be Santa this time, said Fred. But the stockings were empty, and no one had eaten the shortbread sugar snaps. Macduff scratched at the door to go out. Not again, Macduff, said Lucy. Fred had to dig a fresh tunnel. Macduff went to the end. The tapping was gone. Macduff, your sweater is soaking and my galoshes have holes in them, said Fred. No more woofs in the night, Macduff. They all went to bed again. Macduff was very good and quiet. Then he heard a squeak and said, Woof! Macduff, Fred said, I am not digging any more tunnels. You will have to go out by yourself. Macduff disappeared in a world of snow. Where is he? asked Lucy. Oh, I wish I had binoculars. Fred put on his wet galoshes with the holes and followed Macduff's tunnel straight to the garage. Holy Toledo, said Fred. I'm stuck, said Santa. Where is your snow shovel? I've got it, said Fred. I've been digging dog tunnels. Holy Toledo, said Santa. Santa and Fred and Macduff dug the sleigh out of the snowdrift. Lucy had hot soup and sandwiches waiting for them when they came in. It's almost Christmas morning, said Santa. Forgive me if I eat and run. In Fred's stocking were new galoshes. In Lucy's stocking was a pair of binoculars. In the baby's stocking was a pink and blue hippopotamus. Macduff's present was a new friend. She drank three egg cups of milk in a row. Then she settled against Macduff's warm side. And everyone slept until Christmas afternoon. The 